Good evening, everybody. It's Bonnie from Bonnie's Pretty Puppet Reborn Nursery. I hope everybody's well. I hope that you had a wonderful weekend. It is a little bit after 11 here on a Sunday night. So we're winding up the weekend and getting ready for the week ahead. I was wondering if you like my video, would you please push the like button? For those of you who are subscribers and we're growing in numbers, and I, I'm so thankful, and I'm going to say it again, I'm probably getting boring, but I do appreciate it. There's nothing like having a community like the Dolly community, where you can share your love of your babies, your reborns with other people who truly understand. A lot of my friends and family love my dolls. They think they're adorable, but I think only, only the people who are reborn mummies or daddies truly understand how attached and how much you love these babies. We know they're not real. We know that they're dolls, but there's just such an attachment and such a love for them. Sometimes I just look at them and I think I'm so blessed to have them. Um, uh, a lot of times I look at them and feel like I'm blessed. So I do appreciate your subscription. I hope that you're enjoying them. And I, I hope that um, we can continue to make comments to each other. And like I said, if you have a channel, please let me know. I'd love to pop in and see it. Uh, I, I've been making so many new friends ever since I joined the YouTube commu community uh, that I'm just delighted. If you haven't subscribed, I was wondering if you might think about it. Um, we uh, talk about all kinds of dolls, mainly reborns, but we talk about other dolls and we talk about buying them clothing and we talk about just about everything. Uh, our favorite sculpts, personalities that we've given them, and I'm just enjoying myself so much. So if you haven't subscribed, I'm wondering if maybe you would think about it and hope that you would Join us on this adventure. If you like my videos and you'd like to know when I make another one, please push the notification button and they'll tell you when I make a new one. Well, as the title says, I did a haul. You might wonder to yourself, you know, how, how come a lot of my videos are about hauls? And I got to tell you, it's probably my second favorite thing other than re collecting reborns is shopping for them. <laughs> And just going to thrift stores, and not just for the Reborns, but for antiques and things that speak to my heart anywhere I go. And I'm, I'm a bargain hunter. <laughs> so I, um, I appreciate people that um, order, you know, brand new clothes. And I do it sometimes, too, from various shops. But there's just something about the hunt that I enjoy so much. And I really did kind of have a reason this weekend to go. And then I found out there's a couple of reasons why I should go tomorrow, too. But um, for those of you that are new to us, I just now got twins, a boy and girl. And they're the Blue Sparrow by Dor Doris Moyer Hornbogen. And um, they are very big babies. They're 25 inches. One weighs 10 and a half, well, almost 10 and a half pounds. And the other one weighs 7 pounds and 4 ounces. So... Here's the thing. I, I just realized some of, I do have some girl clothes for Poppy. That's the little girl. But poor Jack. I, I either have newborn boys and even a preemie boy, or I have Burke, who is basically the, the Suzanne kit. Um, and he is by uh, Laura Tuzio Ross. And he is basically an 18 months to two toddlers. So those are too big for the Hornbogen Blue Sparrow babies. So I really was trying to find them things. And of course, I saw other cute things that I just had to have too. Before I show you my haul, I'd like to tell you that, introduce you to my little helper tonight. This is a Saskia by Bonnie Brown. And her artist is Chris Hyden with uh, Tiny Hearts Reborn Nursery, and she is just beautiful. She is sporting a three to six month child of mine, pink 
um, pink uh, sleeper. On the sleeper, she has llamas and giraffes. And right on here, it says best cuddler ever. And she is. And uh, it also has a little giraffe on the feet, too, which I think is adorable. And she is one of my favorite sculpts. I just love her eyes. She has these beautiful blue eyes. She's also sporting two flowers, a rose and another flower. They're pink as well. And just a little bit darker shade of pink than her pajama, her sleepers. But I got them at the thrift store too. There was a bag of them. Listen, I've been spending money on bows because I love them. I think there's nothing cuter than a little girl with bow in her hair. So I've been buying a lot from Amazon. I've been going to Burlington. And every time I see bows that I don't have, I have to have them. It's almost an addiction. But... I was so thrilled the other day when I went in, they had a bag of these. They're all similar, although some of them are shiny and some of them are speckled. And But there's several like this in different colors. The bag, there's probably 20 in the bag, and they charged me $1.50. And when you think about how much they are in the store, you think, oh my goodness. So I, I had to buy them. <laughs> She has a couple of her little toys with her, and she has her favorite lovey, which, isn't this cute? It's a caterpillar. I love the colors. It's green and pink, and the, it has polka dots for the inside, and then there's a caterpillar head, but then the picture goes all the way down of the caterpillar. I'm sorry. I If I look like I'm holding my hand funny, the joys of technology, when I was putting my phone into the tripod... To make this video, I pinched myself and it's becoming a blood blister. And it's right on my finger that I use for a lot of things. So it's going to be fun to battle with that. Anyways, I forgot to tell you her name. This is the beautiful Posey Meadows. And she has a twin brother and his name is Silas Andrew. But it was just going to be us girls tonight. And I haven't had Posey on for a while. I've had her on before, but I haven't had her on for a while. So I wanted to bring Posey out. So she could say hi to the aunties, uncles, cousins, friends, and loved ones. We love you, don't we? All right. Without further ado, this is from Old Navy. It's three to six months. Uh, it looks pretty big, though. But I was thinking Zoe, my Damie kit. And then, of course, my new baby, Poppy, who's the Blue Sparrow kit. I love it. It is a light pink. Sorry, Posey, I'm covering your face. It has this beautiful butterfly, and the wings are made up of red, lavender, white hearts. And even his antenna has two hearts. Be adorable for Valentine's Day, too. So this is an Old Navy. It's a romper, or I guess it would still be considered a romper. It's long-sleeved, but it's very, very pretty, and it's even springish. And I keep the air conditioner on really cold in the house, so she could even wear them. They could even wear them during the, the summertime. Uh, this sleeper is a Just One U at 12 months. It looks big, but I'm telling you, Poppy is t almost 10 and a half pounds. So <laughs> I think it's gonna fit her. It might be slightly baggy. It is a light pink for the background. It has feet. And it has the long sleeves with a little bit of lace on the end of the sleeves. And then it has fairies and mermaids. You know, I think they are mermaids because I see a jellyfish and coral. Yeah, they're not fairies at all. They're all mermaids. And they're in purple and cobalt orange and dark pink. And there's even some pretty blue. Um, Just beautiful. Again, Damie Kit. Uh, which is Zoe Anastasia, or my new baby girl. Here's another sleeper. It also is 12 months, just one you. I love the colors. I do. It's the same thing. It has the lacy sleeves, and it is a teal color, and it has bright orange strawberries, ice cream cones, like popsicles, or I guess cream stick ice creams. It has some rainbow ice cream, 
because that's a cone underneath. Just adorable. And I just love that. I just think it's the cutest thing. So Zoe can wear this and Poppy can wear this. Um, let's see. I have a lot of onesies. So this is First Impressions and it's 12 months. I love these. Just a little pair of pants. They are white and those are navy blue. They might be coming out black, but they're navy blue. And they've got lace on the bottom of the, and they're footless. So just a nice pair of pants because I have a ton. And it was the same with Jack. I have a ton of onesies that fit him, but not real outfit outfits. Then we have Carter's 12 months. Beautiful. Again, it kind of reminds me of fruit stripe, stripe gum. But it is a uh, white background, and then it has orange and teal and violet and yellow and and uh, red stripes. Just adorable. Again, got a lot of tops. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Boy, I got all confused here. These are pajamas, actually. They have the bottom cuff. I'm sorry. I did have a pair of... I must have been confused, but these are pajamas. And then look at the top. It's so cute. It has a pink, pink, it has a pink border and a cute little pink bow. And by the way, this is Carter's. And it has rainbows that are actually, if you look at it, the, the shell is a rainbow. And these are actually turtles on it, which I thought was simply adorable. And again, uh, Zoe could wear it, and Poppy could wear it. This is really pretty, too. Another sleeper. This is nine months, so definitely Poppy. But it is white, and it has beautifully embroidered flowers and a watermelon slice. And that's about it, but they are... And then look at the bottom here. They got the little pink lace. That's about it, but it's all um, it's all embroidered, the flowers and the watermelons. The sleeves have pink lace and a little pink bow on it. I don't know if I'm showing you or not because I can't really see what I'm doing here. This is also a Carter's. Just adorable. The feet, it is footless, but they also have lace, pink lace around that. Isn't that adorable? I can't wait to put Poppy in this. This is for my, um, this is Jumping Bean, and it's for my toddler, the Ariana kit, which is Libby. It's just so cute. It has, it's a little skirt. It has pink at the top, and then it has a different hotter pink with light pink circles with a hot pink ring around it. And then at the bottom, it has the light pink and the dark pink stripes. It does have little shorts in it going to be great for the summer. These have all been washed, but some of them I'm going to put away for a few months until it's time for spring. This is also for Libby. This is called Little Last Company. Um, I think it's going to be big on her, but I couldn't help but get it because she's my little princess, and it's a dusty pink, and it says little princess with a bunny and a crown, and the bunny's just adorable. Look at that face. It's got rosy cheeks and freckles and just adorable. Like I said, it may be too big for Libby, but we're going to try it. I think with a pair of Jeggins, it would still be okay. Okay. This is 12 months, so it would be for Zoe and Poppy. Look at this. Another kind of dusty pink. Boy, I, did, I just lucked out on the pink, I guess. It says, OMG, I'm so cute on it. I don't know if you can see that or not. With adorable little bear. And he has flop or she has flowers in her hair and she's carrying some flowers and she do, does have rosy cheeks and she just looks so delighted because her eyes are closed, but they look like they're smiling and a cute little nose. The nose and the flowers are kind of like um, 3D because it, they're, they're uh, plastic that come off of the, off of the, the, uh, the cloth. Here's another one's onesie and again it's pink i don't know i must have been in a pink mood this is 12 months as well another dusty pink it has a blue bow and it's got a little bear on it and she's holding a 
blue or periwinkle maybe a periwinkle balloon that matches the bow and she's so cute she has on a little sundress with periwinkle and pink flowers she has a pink bow in her hair and she too has got rosy cheeks and she looks like she's smiling and having a great time playing with her balloon so cute okay Oh, I don't know. I hope this video is not going to be too, too long. Um, we'll do the best we can here. Maybe maybe I'll save some for later, too. Uh, this is Carter's 12 months. It has a tutu with the cloth underneath that's red or rose-colored, maybe. And it has black polka dots. And the pants are made of black and white stripes. So that was really, really cute. I think I'm going to do a little bit more, and then maybe I'll do a part two. So this will be part one. Um, this is nine months. Again, we're in pink again. We have the little tutu, and we have white pants with silver, silver glittery little dots. So adorable. I can't wait to put Zoe and or uh, Poppy in that. And here's the last one. This is six months. So I maybe posy too. I don't know. It looks a little bit big. It is teal color colored. It has white po polka dots. I can speak today. Really, I can. It says little but mighty. And there's a flamingo and a flower and a little leopard and some more flowers, a butterfly, three hearts. And like I said, it says little but mighty. Now, maybe I'll just kind of push on through. <laughs> Let me show you some of Jack's stuff. Maybe we'll leave it at that. Nine months. This is really cute. It is a one, uh, like a romper sleeper. I guess a play sleeper. It has navy blue and white stripes at the top. It has all kinds of adorable little puppies, including a bulldog that's embroidered here. All the rest of them are all different kinds of dogs. And look at the bottom of the feet actually have blue and white stripes too. That would be for Jack, the blue sparrow kit. Another one for Jack. This is Wonder Sleepwear. It also has a sleeper. I mean feet. I'm sorry. It also has feet. It's cream colored with very light tan stripes. A fox that actually has his hands up. He's playing peekaboo really. It's so cute. Um, this could probably even fit her brother Silas too because it is six months and it may or may not fit Jack. I'll have to check it out. So that's that. I think I'm just going to do a couple more things and then we'll be done for tonight. Six months. Mommy's Rascal and there's a raccoon up here. This is gray and white striped. I love the little pocket. Can you see the little pocket there? And this is a Carter six months, so this will definitely fit Jack. It could possibly fit Silas as well. And then really quick, I'm just going to show you these two sets of one's shoes. This is zero to three months. They're Gerbers. This is how they came. They are mustard colored with white trim. And there's, if you look really close, there's I believe it's either a kitty or something. Um, I don't think it's a bunny because the ears aren't really tall enough. I don't, I don't know. Adorable little uh, mustard tennis shoes. And these are adorable. Um, again, I had to get wider uh, shoes for Poppy. So I think these will fit her. These are from just a thing called Place. They are pink, pink again, sandals for the spring and the summer with, I know these are kitties, but look at the heart nose and the little kitties again is smiling with her eyes closed and the little ears that are kind of 3D. I have more, but I really don't think I should go any longer because there's nothing like going on and then having your, uh, your um, camera cut out on you too. If you're at work, please come home safe to those who love you. And if you're at home, I know you work super hard. Take a chance and time 
to put your feet up, relax, pamper yourself, and don't forget to eat chocolate. That's really important. So aunties, uncles, cousins, loved ones, and friends, just know that we're constantly thinking about you. We enjoy your comments. We love looking at pictures and videos of your babies, and we truly love you. And I have just made so many good friends, even these past few months, that I feel blessed and privileged. And I'd like to thank you for watching my videos. Well, you know what to do. Mwah. Mwah. Look at that finger. We love you. Don't forget it. <laughs> All right. Have a wonderful evening. Have a wonderful new week. God bless you. And we'll see you real soon.